Well, good morning, everybody. It's David George Brook, that gratitude guy with the daily gratitude news for Wednesday, July 22nd, 2020. In the news today, gratitude makes you friendlier. Gosh, another one of the many things we're going to talk about in terms of what the many aspects, rather, that gratitude can do for you. Multiple studies have shown that gratitude induces pro-social behavior. Keeping a gratitude journal is enough to make you more likely to help others with their problems and makes you more likely to offer them emotional support. So why is this true? There are two main reasons gratitude makes people friendlier. Gratitude helps us perceive kindness, which we have a natural tendency to want to reciprocate. Without the feelings of gratitude, we may not recognize when someone is helping us, the same way anger lets us know when someone is trying to harm us. Gratitude makes us happier and more energetic, both of which are highly linked to pro-social behavior. Gratitude helps your marriage. One way marriages start to suffer is that when the passion starts to fizzle, the partners become less appreciative and tend to nag each other. Scientists have put numbers to, uh, to our intuition and experience, creating an appreciation to, to nag ratio more formally called the Losado Ratio. It divides the total number of positive expressions, support, encouragement, and appreciation made during a typical interaction by the number of negative expressions, disapproval, sarcasm, and cynicism. When the ratio was below 0.9, there was 11% more negative expressions than positive expressions. Marriages tended to pummel and head towards divorce. Those marriage, marriages were, that lasted and were found satisfying were those with a positive ratio of above, of above 5.1. Building regular practices of gratitude into your marriage is an easy but effective way to make your positivity ratio go up. I'm sure you want to, uh, to your spouse to appreciate the things you do. Showing them gratitude is just one way to help them give gratitude back to you. Gratitude makes you look good. Ingratitude is universally regarded as Ingratitude is universally regarded to as contempt. Its opposite, gratitude, is considered a virtue in all major religions and most modern cultures. It may not be sexy to be grateful, but people will respect, well, people will respect you for it. Gratitude is not the same thing as indebt indebtedness, which we tend to avoid. Indebtedness, uh, indebtedness is a negative emotion that carries an assumption of repayment for favors done. Gratitude is not the same thing as weakness. Weakness is flattery or subservience. Gratitude is the acknowledgement of kindness with thanks. So that's the message on gratitude today. Again, just some of the many things it can do for you if you allow an attitude of gratitude into your life. That's the news for today. Have a grateful day and we'll see you tomorrow.